Now, reason why it's better, and before I show you all the fancy things it does, is I want to show you the content first. So all of this was generated with AI, from the featured image to the table of contents, right, which is interactive, to the actual content itself, right, what is a garden, benefits of gardening, bolding out some important words or phrases, adding internal links, all automatically, right? Adding in-article images, adding in-article videos. Again, both the images and videos are all relevant to what the content is about. We skim through the article, then we go on YouTube and find relevant articles or relevant videos to add to your articles, as well as, again, more images, internal and external links, so linking out to authoritative sources in your niche. We add tables when they make sense, we add bullets when it makes sense, and of course, we add a call to action to your product or service. Again, all of this generated with AI, and no other competitor is doing this. Furthermore, you can click here to post your integration and your integration can be essentially anything you want. WordPress, Shopify, Ghost, Wix, Webflow, Blogger, Zapier, or even you can use an external API to connect with anything you want. So again, we can skim through these, post them to our integration, or we can just post all to integration, post five out of five, and they're going to be posted to whatever our integration is. Again, Shopify, WordPress, Ghost, any of these ones, right? I won't show you exactly how to generate the content, but there's four modes. The simple mode essentially give it a business URL a description, select how many articles you want, select over 150 different languages because it's very important. If you're targeting the international markets, Portugal, Spain, Greece, Turkish, Turkey, sorry, whatever it is, you want to be able to produce content in these foreign languages to target these international markets. You can do so with this, right? Then there's the titles mode where you give it some titles, again, select the language and click generate and the content is being generated. Then keyword mode, Pretty self-explanatory, give it keywords and the content is going to be generated based on those keywords. Now, the advanced mode, this is where it gets fun. This is where you can add all of the images, videos, internal links. So all the one, things that I just showed you before, this is your article. You can add the featured image, you can add the table of contents, you can add the actual content with the images, right? With the videos, all relevant with internal links, linking out to other pages or blog posts on your site, with external links, linking out to authority sources in your niche, with the tables, with the bullets, with the calls to action. So all this is achieved in this advanced mode, which I won't go over right now, but there's other videos on, videos on the channel, sorry, on how to do this exactly. Now, something more is this right here, autoblog, right? Instead of publishing these articles manually to your site, you can just set up an autoblog, right, that connects journalists, right, with your integration, right? Your integration could be your Shopify blog, WordPress, Wix, whatever it is, whatever you wish to set up. And every single day is gonna post articles to your blog on autopilot, right? These are individual articles right here. Again, you can choose the frequency. You can choose, for example, 300 every single 12 hours or every single month or every single week, right? You can choose however frequency you want. Most people just do five every week and that's that. And again, all these articles, if we expand on one of these, right? This is an individual article. All these articles will have the featured image, table of contents, the content itself, the images, the videos, the internal links, the external links, the calls to action, the tables. They're going to be rich in feature, right? Rich in value and features, right? That's the whole goal of this. Furthermore, these won't just be generic chat GPT content, right? Because you can connect this with your brand, right? If you go here to brands, you can connect Journalist AI with your brand and Journalist AI will learn as much as it can about your brand, right? It will be as knowledgeable as you about your brand or business so it can produce brand tailored content, right? It's super, super powerful. No other tool does this. And even more is that you can produce content in over 150 different languages. So if you're targeting again, targeting, sorry, the international markets, this becomes super, super powerful. You can even use your own custom images if you'd like. Now, one thing we just released is the keyword monitors. And also there's, of course, indexers, so we'll index the content for you. So journalists at the moment does the keyword research for you, then it does the content generation, then does the content publishing, then also does the content indexation. We do all of this for you. Now, with the monitors, you can essentially have journalists generate keyword ideas for you, right? Low difficulty keywords with high search volumes. And just go here, select the keywords you want to produce content for, right? And then just enable here the auto blog. And essentially journalists did the keyword research for you and it's going to start publishing content to your blog based on these keywords, right? Right. Again, all the content with images, internal links, external links, reaching features, so it's ready to rank, right? This is why Journalist AI is the best alternative over any other AI writing tool, right? Because we're focused on automation, right? The whole goal of Journalist AI is to reduce the amount of time that you spend doing manual labor. And I oftentimes use this analogy right here, the ladder analogy. Let's call the step right here money, right? The last step is money because the whole goal 
I would generally say AI and these AI writers is to help you write content to rank on Google so people can find you by searching for certain keywords and be introduced to your brand and eventually buy your products or services. Now, before AI, you had to do all this manually, like doing the keyword research, write the content, proofread it, add images, or f first figure out where to add the images, then add the images, then figure out where to add the links, then add the links and internal links, then do the calls to action. It takes so much time to do all this manually. So it had to go by one of these steps up, up manually. Now with ChatGPT, you more or less start from up here, right? Because it automates some of the stuff for you, not all. But with journalists, we're going to automate all of these processes for you. Keyword research, content generation, content publishing, connecting with any integration you might have, right? We do all of this for you, automating as much as possible. Of course, journalists won't make you jump here. I mean, in some cases it can, right? It depends on the market. But you'll be up here, right? You'll be one step closer to success. That's the whole idea of journalists. That's why it's the best alternative over any other AI tool because we're focused on automation. Again, I won't dive too deep in how it works or the generation. You can try it for yourself. I'll leave a link in the description for this. But again, we automate everything for you. You can set up the indexing automatically for you, keyword, more, keyword uh, research for you, auto blog, integrate with anything you want, use your own custom images, set up your brand so journalists understand their brand and then just hit the road. Super powerful. I'll leave a link for this in the description. Try it out. Let me know what you think. If you like it, great. If not, do let me know why. But yeah, this is an amazing tool. It is one of the best, if not the best, uh, AI software for 2024. If you're trying to rank on Google and trying to produce written content, give journalists AI a go. I'm sure you won't be disappointed. Thank you so much. And again, I'll leave a link in the top comment and in the video description for you to try it out. Thank you so much. And I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.